Okay, 45 minutes in on day 35. We are in Camden, Maine. And we are getting there. We are getting there. Starting to look like the ocean. We're rolling up the Atlantic Highway, US 1. And uh, it's been kind of hilly this morning. Ups and downs, up and down. Nothing uh, too major just yet. Uh, there is a pretty big climb on the docket for today. We're gonna go up Cadillac Mountain. Yeah, that's today. The itinerary is get up before first light, check. Get on the road at a good hour, roll out right at seven from Warren, and uh, take it real easy today, because at mile 90, we got ourselves a good old fashioned mountain to climb in Acadia National Park. So, that is indeed the plan. We'll be finishing up today, if all goes well. So I'd be lying to you if I said there was no emotion going on this morning, but uh, we're keeping everything under control here for a while. The thought of climbing up the Cadillac Mountain is certainly enough to keep your head screwed on straight. I'm looking forward to it. So last night was a lot of fun. I think the, uh, the partying has officially begun even with a day to go, and I shouldn't do that because I've bonked out of much easier rides than this one. We got about 100 and, 104 today, I think. And uh, some of it's gonna be pretty tough. Well, we'll get there. But yeah, last night, Lana and I found a nice uh, restaurant right down on the mouth of the St. George River, I believe it was. Got some fresh seafood. And uh, went out to it. Irish pub afterwards and I met me a genuine lobster fisherman captain of, a, of an 80 foot boat now that was a tough man so we had a few beers together last night it was a good time that is somebody I won't forget I'll, uh, I'll write down a few things in the blog but yeah he was also very uh, and helpful, I guess is the word, on where to go in Acadia and where to go in Bar, excuse me, in Bahaba to get a good piece of lobster and beer. So that's what we're up to. Okay, two hours in on day 35. We are in Belfast. And they got a lot of fancy boats here. Really can't see the ocean, but there are certainly an easily passable water channel to get there. I am currently on a pedestrian bridge over this fine river. I don't know which one it is. But uh, if I was actually doing any riding, I'd be up on Highway 1 there. I'll bet you there's a way to get on it from this other side over here.
morning's ride's been nice and challenging. Lots of rolling hills. Looks like the tide's coming in right now. Water flowing upstream. Yeah, we picked up a wind out of the north, which has made the, the climbs a little tougher. But if it stays there, which I would very much enjoy, my course today takes me up to Bucksport, which is about 20 more miles heading north, and then cut straight east, and then I turn south for the afternoon to get out to Mount Desert Island. So, that wind can stay right there. That would be just fine with me. Another thing we should talk about, it is yet another beautiful, beautiful day out here. Just gorgeous. Blue sky, sunlight. It's in the middle 70s now. It'll probably get a little warm today, but uh, if I stay on task, I won't be out in the heat of the afternoon. Actually, what am I saying? I'm going to be in the middle of a climb. It's a Cadillac Mountain. Anyway, good, uh, good challenging bike ride. I'll get that emotional stuff back in, back in order. There haven't been any, <laughs> been many thoughts about dipping the wheel in the last hour or so. It's been a nice hard ride, which is great. I'll take that for a while. The other change up here, no sleeves today. Decided to put on as much sunscreen as I can take and uh, whatever burns, burns. But uh, today is a day for our corporate sponsors. Oddparity.com, Team Odd Ones. We always thank you for your support. Yeah, what a beautiful day. I think what I'll do is take one more look around here at these fancy boats and get rolling. Got a mountain to climb. <laughs> 